All right, Pikey, um, how would you sum up your season in 2013? Yeah, I, I think it was another year um, that we'll probably all be a little bit disappointed with. Um, to go to the prelim, I think, is a great effort, but um, it feels a long way short of a grand final and a grand final victory, so it's obviously a bit disappointing after last year. Well, it's hard to overlook what's just happened on the weekend. Can you talk about some of the highlights you have had this year? Um, I think, uh, on a personal side, I think I improved my game, which is what I would try and do every year. Um, so I was reasonably pleased with that. Um, and then on a broader sense, I think it was great that we got some really good recognition across the team and, and Dan and Jared and um, Nick Melcheski, Josh. Um, I'm missing someone here. Kieran Jack. And Kieran Jack, yeah, I mean, he was pretty good. Um, those guys, I think they really stepped their game up. Um, and it will, it will hold well for us next year. And I think also with um, Kurt getting a full season next year, it's probably good things to come for us. You mentioned your own game there. What are some of the general improvements you think you made? Um, I think my marking improved, um, which was good. Um, being able to probably affect the scoreboard as well um, was a positive. Um, and then I think just generally my understanding of the game is, is going up again and I think you know, further. Um, there's so many good players out there now that you really have to continue improving if you want to want to get better. And um, yeah, so it's it's been a good year um, for all of us, I think. It's but it's hard to to sort of see it that way when you don't go all the way. Uh, looking at some of your teammates, who would you say are some of the more the most improved players this year? Well, I think probably guys have got recognition for what they're doing more this year. I think there's some guys have definitely gone up and improved, but not probably by the leaps and bounds that everyone outside the club sees. Um, that said, I think probably the biggest improver would have to be Dane Rappi. Um, what he's been able to do to come in as a rookie and play almost every game this year has been exceptional. Um, so I'm really looking forward to seeing him develop next year. The boys came very close this year. Are there any improvements as a team that you think might help to, to surge the team forward in 2014? Yeah, I think um, probably our ball movement needs to improve a bit. Um, and after that, I think um, for the most part, we have pretty good structure. We have really good structures and good game plan. And um, I think sometimes, um, when you, as you said before, when you don't win the grand final, you tend to think you have to start from scratch. And really, a preliminary final um, is a pretty good effort. And you know, we we're probably maybe a quarter and a half of bad football away from being in a granny again. So. Um, I don't think huge amounts of improvement have to happen. It's just those small little one, two percent. And six, six debutants this year. No doubt there'll be a bit of a battle for spots next year then. Yeah, no doubt. Um, there is every year. It's sort of, there's always a bit of turnover um, and people are, all, all the kids are hungry. So um, it's good for the guys who, who've got their spots at the moment. They have to keep improving and have that pressure underneath them. But, um, you know, it's just a professional sport. It doesn't get easy. And finally, a well-deserved break coming up. What are your plans of the off-season? Um, mostly hanging around here. Um, I think we'll head back home for Christmas, so there's a few weddings in the off-season that we'll be attending. And um, other than that, just take it easy with the family.